hello friends once again welcome back to my channel if you are new to our channel subscribe our channel and please watch the video till the end if i make any changes you can be able to note that easily so don't skip the video and watch till the end as there is no hurry and friends these are completely my probable answers if you are finding any mistakes you can choose options on your own of the particular questions so these are completely my answers in my perspective and this is week 4 cloud computing answers the first question configuration of a1.large so the answer for first question is option b that is 2v cpus and 4096 mb ram and coming to second question they have given two statements google app engine is an iaas product of gcp and google compute engine is a platform pas means platform as service component of gcp friends here both are false because iaas that is infrastructure as service google app engine belongs to PAS and Google Compute Engine belongs to IAS but here they have given completely opposite so both statements are false option D is the correct answer and coming to third question again they have given two statements about fixed IP and fixed IP and floating IP so I think the answer is C both statements are true so friends if you feel anyone as incorrect if you know the correct answer exactly comment in the comment section as other subscribers or other viewers can also be able to see and correct that so according to me answer is C you can choose on your own answer and coming to fourth question there are four options regarding Google Cloud Platform Storage whether they are correct or not we have to identify and mark it this is multiple answer question so there are two answers for this possible answers option C along with option D and fifth question the answer is option B that is she, he, she or he enters the deployment user password of Azure account while it asks for password and coming to sixth question azure app supports deploy content of web app through ftp local gift github visual studio team services and bitbucket so it is true only so option a true mark option a and coming to seventh question microsoft azure app service plan includes so there are four options and all four all four options are correct so mark option a b c d all are correct answers and coming to eighth question what code functions does keystone perform so friends the answer is option d authentication and identity service so mark option d Coming to last but one question, that is ninth question. Which of the following statements are true about resource group in Microsoft Azure? So the answer for this is option C. It deploys web apps, databases, and storage accounts. And coming to tenth and the final question of, of this week so the question is simple they match the following columns and they have given a b c and three type of google services google app engine google cloud endpoint and also google api so friends you have to match the correct characteristics or correct functions they belong to so i am going to clear it and make it easy for you option a google app engine 
which perform as it will considers to migrate your web application to gcp that is google cloud platform and and also google cloud endpoint which means it helps uh, end users it helps end users application scalability and c obviously google api it integrates google services into end users application so friends now you got the answer that is a3 b1 c2 that is option c so friends mark this option c as correct answer for 10th question so friends if you found video helpful subscribe our channel like the video and share to your friends and until then be safe be happy stay strong keep supporting us until then thank you bye